Hey everybody, this is Darkside. Welcome back to part 17 of our Dark Souls walkthrough. As you see here, we're taking on the Great Wolf Sith. Okay, really the key with this boss is he's very, very fast. And he will overwhelm you if you let him have half the opportunity. So just evade his attacks, try to keep out of the way of that sword, and then whenever he does, usually a double attack is whenever we're going to try to go in and get under him. That's where he's weakest. Also, if you see there, if you get caught by an attack and you need to heal, the best time to do it is while he's attacking. So make sure you bait an attack, get out of his way, and while he's doing it, Feel free to have a quick chug. So I'm waiting here for him to do those attacks like that, just to basically stagger himself for just a second so we can get in under him. Take a few pop shots at his belly. He's usually pretty quick about jumping off of you right there. Now that attack that he just did where he jumps on top of you and then jumps off of you. Not much you can do about it. You can try to get in a couple of swings. But if you're using a slower weapon like I am. Chances are he's going to be long gone before you, that thing ever gets off. He caught me with that one pretty good. Now you know, wondering probably why that I'm going ahead and drinking before my health gets down real low, and that's because he does have a few attacks that if you get caught on unawares, that will nearly one-shot you, or at least at near the level I'm at. And I think I've fought him around 33, 34. And when opportunity presents itself, get under him and go to town. So I got lucky there and he actually wound up doing a few attacks and not moving. This is something he doesn't normally do. Caught me with that one real good, too. Now, while you're actually fighting him here, you see that I keep lock on on most of the time. And that's mainly just so I can keep my shield out in front of me. So just in case I'm baiting attacks and he actually strikes the tip of that shield, well, I don't take a serious amount of damage. Patience is the key to this fight. Nothing more, nothing less. As soon as you start getting impatient with what he's doing is the moment he will kill you. And don't forget to pick up the Hornet Ring. Very good PvP item for you backstabbers out there. Now one of the last things I want to do in this video, I know this one's going to be short today, is we're going to show you how to get the Enchanted Ember. First off, you have to take out two of the large mushroom guys in a small clearing with a pond in it, right close to where the Great Wolf Sif was. Simply remove them. 
stay away from their attacks because they hit like a train. Go grab your ember. Last thing we want to do here is to head up to the ruins, go around the side of it, and you'll find a chest that contains the stone armor. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching part 17 of the Dark Souls walkthrough. If you like this video, please click the like button. And if you'd like to see more, please click subscribe. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.